Congo River Run is a popular vacation spot for families during the summer, but after rescue crews were called for a missing kayaker, the company's owner is teaming up with the fire department to raise money for a rescue boat. Wayne 15's Angelica Robinson joins us now from LaGrange County. The owner says crews were out until midnight looking for this missing woman. When they found her, it was clear she was intoxicated, the owner says, and she wasn't wearing a life jacket. Tammy Scalzo, the owner of Mongo River Run, said she learned the woman was missing about 10 o'clock last night when a man who went kayaking with her showed up alone. The Mongo Fire Department was called to the scene, but their search efforts were limited because the department does not have its own rescue boat. They called in the neighboring Stro Fire Department for help. Once they put the boat in the water, they traveled about 30 minutes up the river. That's when they found the woman lying in the grass. The owner says she appeared to be drunk, but she was not hurt. She says this highlights the importance of water safety. She also says it's clear that the fire department is in need of a rescue boat. Always wear your life jacket, and alcohol and water don't always mix. We haven't recovered our boat, but it was her that, that mattered at that point. Mm -hmm. uh, never leave your party. And if you fall out of your boat, you lose your boat, make your way to shore. Um, there's bridges and spots throughout here that you can see landmarks that you can go to and if you can keep your cell phone with you um, that dispatch can use that to ping your location makes our search and rescue efforts easier the boat will cost an estimated seventy five hundred dollars in august mongo river run will host a canoe trip fundraiser half of the proceeds will go to the fire department we'll have more information on the fundraising efforts on our website wayne.com reporting in mongo angelica robinson wayne 15 news